with this breaking news alert. All right, he's in custody, and uh, we're uh, we're going to find out what, what we know about that. So he's in custody right now. Yes, yes, he has just been taken into custody. After a few hours on the run, just as our crews were getting an update on a deadly stabbing suspect, he was taken into custody. John Donaldson is accused of stabbing his mother and sister-in-law to death. He stabbed another sister-in-law as well. She is in the hospital with very serious injuries. The stabbing started at an apartment, then it moved to a home. I know it had a lot of us rattled when he was on the run, just until that very moment you heard from Don Aaron. Now, at the children and other families, this is the really sad part, witnessed all of that trauma. All right. So there's obviously a lot that's going on here that we're following. Our Tosin Fikile was at one of the scenes today. This is where she learned all the information from police and talked to one of the victim's family members. Police say that man stabbed his mother and two sister-in-laws. Right now, that man is in custody. According to police, they say that man stabbed his mother at this apartment complex. Now, that unit that you're looking at behind me with the sliding door open is where we've seen officers concentrate a lot of their efforts. Now, take a look at this video. News 4 was there when the suspect, 32-year-old John Donaldson, was being put into an ambulance. Police say he was taken into custody by a motel on Whitebridge and Charlotte Pike in West Nashville. According to police, just after 11 a.m., they got a call about a critical stabbing at the, this apartment on Elm Hill Pike. And about an hour after that, they got another call about a critical stabbing at a home on Hickory Dale Drive. Police say Donaldson came to this apartment on Elm Hill Pike and stabbed his mother first and then stabbed his sister-in-law, who they say was trying to shield two children who were in the home at that time. They believe Believe Donaldson then took his mother's car and drove to the home of his brother and sister-in-law on Hickory Dale Drive. Police say he knocked on the door, and when no one answered, he kicked down the door and then stabbed his sister-in-law to death. A child was at the home when that happened. Police say none of the children at both locations were harmed. According to police, Donaldson's other sister-in-law has critical stab wounds and is at Vanderbilt Hospital. It's hard to stop any type of domestic situation. Uh, he came home to his mother. Uh, I, I wish my mom was still alive. I could go home and hug her. Uh, but he came home to his mom and did this horrendous crime. She's all about family. She loves, and you know, that we all need to be a family. And for this to happen, it's, it's kind of hurting for me because she just came back from her brother. She said that we all gonna start being a family and try to be more with each other. So for this to happen today is kinda it's kinda cliche. Now, those two men who you just heard from say they are the brothers of the suspect in this case. They tell me their mother, Jackie, just turned 56. They say she turned 56 a few weeks ago. Police say they believe that Donaldson was kicked out of this apartment complex here and was told not to return, and they say he returned today in a rage. Police say one criminal warrant was issued for his arrest, and they're looking to get a second one. For WSMB4, I'm Tosin Fikile. Now, if we learn any more information on this breaking news tonight, we will post it on our website as well as in the free News 4 app.